Just look at the person beside you and tell them it's good to see you in the house of the Lord. Come on. Tell the person behind you it's good to see you in the house of the Lord. Praise God, praise God, praise God. Yes, it's good to see you. Hallelujah. Praise God. I want to greet our bishop, Bishop Dr. C. Everton Thomas, in the wonderful name of Jesus. Put your hands together for the man of God tonight. And for our beautiful, lovely pastor, Pastor Jillian Thomas. <laughs> The woman of the season, my God, the one who is standing and just being obedient to God in this season. And we know that God honors obedience. Amen, somebody. You see, God will test you to bless you. Oh, God. I, I, I want to I say that again. God will test you to bless you. Come on, somebody. He will test you. He will try you he will put you through some stuff just to bless you so there's a blessing in this season ah the, the, the fact that i'm here i'm gonna receive a blessing my god Woo! i, I don't even have to shout a hallelujah to get it the fact that i am here in this season i'm already blessed I'm already blessed. I'm already delivered. I'm already favored. I wish somebody could get that in your spirit. It's already happening. My God. It, it's set in motion by the Holy Ghost. Woo! What an awesome God we serve. There's a song that's in my spirit. I don't know it very well. But as I was here... And as I was listening to the worship on the inside, it, it just, it lines up with the, top, with, the, with the topic that I have tonight. Praise God. I want to greet those in, 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 Zoom, in Zoom or YouTube or Facebook land. God bless you. God bless you. Praise God. And it says, he turned it. He turned it. He turned my morning into dancing. He turned it. Lord God, look at somebody and say, God is turning it. Is, is a praise team. I see my keyboard player knows it very well. Let's see if we can do it. Woo. Can we get the words up on the screen? He turned it. I know Elder might know it, you know. She'll give him a microphone. There are some times when I feel mm -hmm. Can't get the words up here? Or while we are putting up the words Go to the book of Esther with me We're in the book of Esther sometime tonight We're in the book of Esther So you're going to go to Esther chapter 3 Hold on to Esther chapter 3 And then we're going to go all the way around to Esther chapter 9 and then we're going to go to Matthew. Yeah. He turned my morning into dancing. And he turned my sorrow into pain. And if I can't get it, we're going to do that song tonight at some point. So while they're looking for it, let's go to the word of the Lord. We're in the book of Esther chapter 3. And then we're going to go over to Esther chapter 9. And then we're going to go to the book of Matthew. It says, After these things, that King Azurus promote Haman, the son of Amadatai, the Agite, and advanced him, and set his seat above all the princes that were with him. And all the king's servants that were in the king's gate bowed and reverenced Haman. For the king had so commanded concerning him. But Mordecai bowed not, nor did him reverence. Then the king's servants, which were in the king's gate, said unto Mordecai, Why transgressest thou the king's commandment? Now it came to pass when they spake daily unto him, and he hearkened not unto them, 
that they told Haman to see whether Mordecai's matters would stand, for he had told them that he was a Jew. And when Haman saw that Mordecai bowed not, nor did him reverence, then was Haman full of wrath. And he thought scorn to lay hands on Mordecai alone. For they had showed him the people of Mordecai. Wherefore, Amon sought to destroy all the Jews that were throughout the whole kingdom of Azuras, even the people of Mordecai. In the fifth month, that is the month of Nisan, in the twelfth year, King Azuras, they cast per. And this is a lot before Amon, from day to day and from month to month to the twelfth month, that is the month of Adar. And Amon said unto King Azuras, There is a certain people scattered abroad and dispaired among the people in all the provinces of the kingdom, and their laws are diverse from all the people. Neither keep they the king's laws. Therefore it is not for the king's profit to suffer them. If it please the king, let it be written that they may be destroyed. And I will pay 10,000 talents of silver to the hands of those that have charge of the business to bring it into the king's treasuries. And the king took his ring from his hand and gave it unto Haman, the son of Amadatiah, the Agite, the Jews, and Nemi. And the king said unto Haman, the silver is given to thee, the people also to do with them as it seemeth good to thee. Then were the king's scribes called on the thirteenth day of the first month, and there was written according to all that Haman had commanded unto the king's lieutenants and to the governors that were over every province, and to the rulers of every people of every province according to the writing thereof, and to every people after their language, in the name of the king Azurus, was it written and sealed with the king's ring. Going over to chapter 9. And we are reading from verse 11 to verse 14. And then we're going to skip over to verse 20, right to 25. Verse 11 says, On that day... The number of those that were slain in Shushan, the palace, was brought before the king. And the king said unto Esther, the queen, The Jews have slain and destroyed five hundred men in Shushan, the palace, and the ten sons of Haman. What have they done in the rest of the king's provinces? Now, now, what is thy petition and it shall be granted thee or what is thy request further lord have mercy and it shall be done and then said esther if it please the king let it be granted to the jews which are in shushan to do tomorrow also according unto this day's decree and let Haman's ten sons be hanged upon the gallows. And the king commanded it so to be done. And the decree was given at Shushan, and they hanged Haman's ten sons. Verse 20, And Mordecai wrote these things and sent letters unto all the Jews that were in all the provinces of the king Azurus, both nigh and far, to establish this among them that they should keep the 14th day of the month Adar and the 5th day of the same yearly as the days were wherein the Jews rested from their enemies and the month which was turned unto them from sorrow to joy. Lord have mercy. And mourning into a good. I'm going to read it again. As the days wherein the Jews rested from their enemies. And the month which was turned unto them from sorrow to joy. And from mourning into a good day. That they should make them days of feasting and joy. And of sending portions one to another and gifts to the poor. And the Jews undertook 
do as they had begun and as Mordecai had written unto them. Because Haman, the son of Amadatiah, the Agite, the enemy of all the Jews, had devised against the Jews to destroy them and had cast poor, that is, the lot to consume them and to destroy them. But when Esther came before the king, he commanded by letters that his wicked device, which he devised against the Jews, should return upon his own head, and that he and his sons should be hanged on the gallows. Yes, God, Father, we thank you for your presence. We thank you, my God, that you are in this building tonight. And we pray, God, that you will release this word into the atmosphere. Send a rhema word tonight, God. Send a word, oh God, that will effect change. Send a word, my God, that will change the trajectory of life. Send a word, mighty God, that will restore, that will heal, that will deliver, that will set us free in Jesus' name. Somebody say amen. We'll go back to the song. Before you take your seat, look at your neighbor. So neighbor overturned look at somebody else and say neighbor overturned Lord have mercy sit down for a bit overturned in this season of REM restoration revelation elevation and manifestation it is a time where we are seeing some unprecedented move of God. We are hearing of testimonies. We are seeing it. We are experiencing it. We are living it. Amen, somebody. And we're seeing God move like never before. It is a season where anything and everything you can go, God bless you, is possible. Amen, somebody. It is a season where once you speak something, you ought to believe that it is done. My God. It is a season where once you have a little bit of faith, God is going to do wonders. Amen, somebody. It is a season where you have to stand on the word of God in this time and believe the report of the Lord. Amen, somebody. It is a season that while God is moving, the enemy will also be working. Come on, somebody, because the enemy doesn't take a day off. Come on, somebody. He's always busy working he has to carry out his assignment which is to do what kill and steal and to destroy but we also know that we serve a God who has come to block and to stop the plans of the enemy somebody say yes it is a season uh, where petitions are being granted once we ask. And that's why I say to people, ask and it shall be given unto you. Seek and you shall find. It is a axing season. My God. It's not only a believing season, but it's an axing season. Whatever you are axing God for tonight, my God, it is going to be granted unto you once you believe somebody say yes. Now, it's a season where God is overturning the evil plans of the enemy. Yes, it's a season where God is allowing what the enemy is trying to do to you. He is allowing it to work for your good. Sometimes we can see the good that God is working on. But look at somebody and tell them good is coming. A good 
day is coming. A good hour is coming. A good month is coming. A good season is coming. Look at somebody say, good is on the way. My God, it's a season where God wants to cancel the sabotaging plans of the adversary. My God, he wants to cancel out some untimely debts and uh, cancel out some lacks and cancel out some fears and uh, cancel out some doubts and uh, cancel out some setbacks. Somebody say cancel. Yes, it is your season to see God move. Somebody say he's going to move and he's going to move right now. Somebody say yes. You got to understand men and brethren that in this season, uh, your breakthrough or your blessing uh, is predicated only on two things uh, your level of faith and your expectation to receive I'm going to say that again your blessing my God or your breakthrough is predicated on two things your faith in this season and your expectation to believe what am I saying? If you got faith, it means you got expectation. And if you got expectation, it means you got some kind of faith. And if I got those two things, then I can expect God to move on my behalf. Somebody say yes. It is a believing season to believe God for crazy things. To believe that God is able to do Exceeding abundantly above all I could ever ask or think. It's a season when my faith is going to shift to another level. It's my season that even when I'm crying, I'm going to trust God. Even when they tell me no, I'm still going to trust God. Even when the doors are closed, I'm believing for windows to be open. It almost shunned it's that kind of season. Somebody say yes. And in this season, I am believing that God is working out things in my favor. I'm believing that God is about to overturn some stuff. I'm believing that God is about to manifest his glory. I'm believing that God is about to show this world that he is not dead but he is alive and well I don't serve a dead God I don't serve a fictitious God I serve Emmanuel God with us Jehovah Jireh my provider he is not only a way maker he is a miracle worker he is a promise keeper he is the light in the darkness somebody say yes he's gonna overturn some stuff uh, we find then that the definition of the word overturn it means to abolish, uh, invalidate, uh, or reverse. Lord God, uh, it means abolish, uh, invalidate, uh, or reverse. Uh, my God, it also means canceled, uh, uh, repeal, or uh, revoke retract my God look at somebody and say God is about to retract some stuff in your life Lord have mercy he is about to cancel some stuff reverse some stuff abolish some stuff you ain't helping me tonight oh God and then I know this tonight that if God is absolute then nothing happens to me by chance it is all orchestrated by God I remember Remember sometime I told somebody that even if it is orchestrated by the enemy, he had to get approval first from God to do it. And so it is still a setup from God. Lord God Almighty, help me up in this place. Uh, the Bible tells us then that God is in control of everything. 
Mm -hmm. And he has uh, the final say. Uh, according to Psalms 2 and verse 4, he says, uh, He that sitteth in the heavens uh, shall laugh. Uh, the Lord shall have them in derision. Uh, I want to tell somebody tonight that God is getting to laugh. Lord God Almighty, help me tonight. Uh, God is getting ready to laugh. Uh, you know, many times when you are going through stuff uh, and you are going through situations, the enemy tends to like to laugh at you laugh at your struggles laugh at your setbacks laugh at your disappointments but don't worry about it he who laughs 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 best I don't have nobody up in this place tonight I say God has the final say God has the last laugh don't cut me out yet I might be down in round five, but there's still seven rounds to go. Lord, help me up in this place. Hello, Shandai. Don't count me out just yet. Don't write me off just yet. Don't step up. I just heard uh, cancel that celebration. Lord God, don't have your celebration just yet. Take back your invitations. Don't send them out just yet. I still got some praise in me. I still got some joy in me. I still got some fire in me. Sit down just for a minute. Let me take you where I want to go. We're going to shout in a bit. And so the Bible tells us that God has everything under control. It was he who spoke and things came into existence. He stepped out into chaos. He stepped out into darkness. And he said, let there be. And there was. That's the kind of God we serve. He is the supreme being. According to Colossians 1 and 16 it says uh, for by him was everything created uh, and without him uh, was nothing created uh, so in other words if you want to see a miracle we keep saying this uh, just take a good look at yourself uh, and look at your neighbor uh, and you can know how good God is uh, God spoke things and it manifests uh, he is undefeated uh, uh, nobody can evict him from his throne Lord Jesus God takes counsel from nobody he doesn't need nobody's approval to make his next move he doesn't need nobody to write off what he is going to do he just does it when he wants to ah, God is and was and will always be God before time there was God and when time ceased to exist God will still be God I said when time ceases to exist God will still be God he's God in the good times he's God in the bad times he's God when you're happy and he's God when you're sad he's God in your disappointments and he's God in your success he is God all by himself oh, come on somebody he is in which means he's too great or extreme to express or describe in words I can't find enough words to talk about my God because if I call him amazing then I say he's wonderful if I say he's wonderful then I gotta say he's great and when I say he's great then I say how he's awesome and when I say he's awesome I say he's miraculous and after miraculous he is fantastic he's a sweet rose of Sharon he's a lily of the valley he's the brightest of of the morning star he is a mighty God somebody stand and praise him in this place I give you one minute to praise him in this place 
Open your mouth and praise him in this place. Open your mouth and shut back him in this place. Woo. Sit down with your worship. God is incomparable, which means he's matchless, without an equal. My God, he is incomprehensible. He's not able to be understood. In other words, every time I think I have figured God out, my God, he goes and does something different. And I can't understand him. I can put him in a box he cannot be put into a box he's not that kind of God to be put into a box Lord Jesus nothing can hold him and nothing can restrict him he is unrestrictable Lord Jesus somebody praise him up in this place we serve a God who is mind blowing and a God who is able to do anything now when you look at God's resume it speaks for itself if you need him to be a provider ask Moses ah, that God fed them in the wilderness with manna from above they had no supermarkets they had nobody to bring them anything they were in a dry place a secluded place but God came through for them somebody help me up in this place if you want a healer at Naaman he sent Naaman down to the river and said dip in some dirty water and you shall receive your healing mighty God of Daniel if you want to know if he has a resurrective power uh, then all you got to do is ask Lazarus he was dead for four days his flesh was eaten by worms uh, the Bible said that they said by this time he he stinketh, but because he is the resurrective king, he said, Lazarus, come forth. And the worms had to spit him out. The maggots had to spit him out. He and die. And that tells me tonight, if God can speak to Lazarus and resurrect Lazarus, then there is nothing impossible for God to do if you want to know if he can bring you out of your situation let's go back to Joshua uh, going over to Jordan he said don't worry I'm gonna be with you and he parted Jordan and they walked out on dry land if you want to know if he can protect you in prison just ask Daniel he was trapped in the lion's den with some very hungry lions but then the lion of the tribe of Judah that breaks every chain was already in the dance and every knee shall bow and every tongue confess that he is Lord if you want to know if he can turn water into wine Mary am I preaching to anybody in this place if you want to know if you can raise the dead check Jairus if you want to know if he can dry up your issues check the woman with the issue of blood if you want to know if he's a mighty warrior go back to Exodus jump into Leviticus check Deuteronomy land of Asatai check Joshua in the Messiah we serve a mighty God we serve an awesome God stand on your feet for a minute Yeah, you help me. Put it on the screen. You got one minute to 
give him an extraordinary praise. A praise that says, just because you are God, just because you are God, just because you are God, just because you are God. Shanda, Rabakushata, I'm praising you just because you are God, just because you're Elohim, just because you're Jehovah Nishi, just because you're Jehovah Macadesia, you are God. Sit down in your worship. Woo! Now that I've laid my foundation, we can go to the text. Uh, the Bible tells us in Esther chapter 3 that Haman was promoted. He got promotion by King Azurus. And his promotion put him in second to command to that of the king. His promotion was sealed with the king's ring. Anybody who wears the king's ring uh, does and would uh, command uh, the same greeting that you would give to the king. So the Bible tells us that this promotion set him above everybody else in the kingdom. And so when he would go out, uh, they would begin to bow before him in reverence as they would do uh, to the king. And because he had on the king's ring, then you had to, by decree of the Medes and Persians laws, follow through in reverencing the person that was promoted next to the king. Now the Bible tells us that every day when Amon would go out, Mordecai, who was a Jew, refused to bow before Haman. Which means uh, he refused to honor and uh, accept Haman's position. Yes, uh, he refused uh, to put and come in alignment with everybody else uh, that he agreed with what the promotion that was given to Haman. Now, because of this, uh, a rivalry uh, was brought up. And so uh, Haman despised Mordecai. And not only did Haman despise Mordecai, but we then recognize that the people who worked with Haman also despised Mordecai and uh, they despised him so much that they said unto him why is it uh, that you refuse uh, to honor the king's commandment uh, and day in and day out uh, Mordecai refused uh, to bow to Haman now, now this provoked Haman to a place of anger and wrath so much uh, that when he thought of laying hands on Mordecai uh, he despised the very thought of touching him uh, and he refused uh, to lay hands on him but not just lay hands on him uh, he recognized that I am not just going to take up my vengeance on Mordecai uh, but I am going to take it out on anybody uh, associated with you. Uh, and so it is that as we go through this season, we recognize uh, that the battle is real. My God, uh, the warfare is not normal. Uh, it has been intensified uh, because there are some Caymans uh, who don't just like us. Come on somebody talk to me we're going somewhere uh, there are some Haman that despises you uh, there is somebody somewhere that doesn't like you uh, and not only do they not like you they don't like your children uh, and they don't like your father and they don't like your mama uh, and they don't 
like nobody associated with you. Uh, help me up in this place, Holy Ghost. Uh, they don't like your friends uh, and anybody that talks with you. I, I think I'm going somewhere. Help me, Jesus. And so it is when they are planning to take you down. They want to take down everybody associated with you. And that's how the devil works. And sometimes uh, prior warriors can agree with me. When the enemy can't touch you, he goes after your children. And when he can't get your children, he goes after your job. And when he can't get your job, he goes after your marriage and when he can't get your marriage he goes after your health and when he can't get your health he goes after your money and when he can't get your money he goes after your ministry Lord help me Jesus and so we find then uh, that there are some caimans around and I'm not just talking about people I'm talking about spirits Lord Jesus because some of you always think that we're preaching on people we ain't got time to preach on people I come to identify the spirits because this warfare ain't a physical one it's a spiritual warfare so I don't got a problem with you but I don't like the spirit associated with you. I don't like the spirit that is attached to you. I don't like the spirit that is working behind you. Uh, and so Haman had a spirit of anger and bitterness and covetousness and even a little jealousy Lord God because he hated Mordecai without a cause now let's break it down imagine out of everybody else that bows down every day to you every day you recognize the one person that doesn't bow I don't think that Mordecai would have made himself available in the front he was probably somewhere in the back but you got some spirits and you got some people too who are working with some spirits that no matter where you are they find you my God they pick on you my God they just can't seem to get enough and so the Bible says that Haman went to Azul Zeros the king and he devised a plot he said well guess what I know of some people that are in your province and they don't align to that of the laws of the Medes and the Persians they don't align up to your mission statements they don't fall in line with the vision of the company oh Jesus they they don't look the part. They don't sound the part. Oh God. And I want to get rid of these people. I want to get rid of these people so bad. That I want to pay somebody to wipe them out. Do you know that there are people in this time who seem to be paying people to wipe you out? I'm going to preach it like I feel it tonight. I'm sorry. Yes, they want to pay some witches and pay some food doctors and pay some obia man, Lord Jesus, to wipe you out. They want to gang up with some people on the job to get you fired. They want to gang up with some professors uh, to give you the wrong grade. Uh, they want to sabotage your study group. Uh, can I preach like I feel it? Uh, they don't want to see you bless. Uh, they can't stand to see you bless. Uh, they can't stand to see you going forward. Uh, they want to hold you backward. Uh, but I'm here to tell somebody tonight, uh, I ain't going back. Uh, I'm going Going forward, I ain't going back to poverty. I ain't going back to brokenness. I ain't going back to confusion. I ain't going back to suicidal thoughts. I ain't going back to a broken marriage.
change. I'm going forward in the name of Jesus. So the Bible tells us that the king said to Haman, guess what, guess what? You already have my ring. You already have my signature. I'm going to give you the money. Here is the silver, my God. And the people are in your hands to do what you want to do with them. Does this sound familiar? Judas betrayed Jesus with some silver, my God. And the Bible tells us that Haman began he left the presence of the king he was excited he was ecstatic he was rejoicing because he got the clearance to go ahead Jesus he got the okay to go ahead and do what he wanted to do. So the Bible tells us that they released the notes and the letters in the provinces. And Amen declared, and this is what they said. Almighty oh, God, that they are going to release in the month of Adar. Yes, they are going to release. He said, then were the king's scribes called on the 13th day of the first month and there was written according to all that Haman had commanded unto the king's lieutenants and to the governors that were over every province and to the rulers of every people of every province according to the writing thereof and to every people after their language in the name of King Azurus was it written and sealed with the king's ring and it says and the letters were sealed sent by post into all the king's provinces to destroy, to kill, and to cause to perish all Jews, both young and old, little children and women, in one day. My God, up on the 13th day of the 12th month, which is in the month Adar. So he put it into writing. He went immediately and said, I've got to get rid of these people. I got to wipe them out. But let me tell you something. He forgot one thing. He didn't know something about these people. That these people were chosen by God. Lord have mercy. That these people had a reputation with a particular man upstairs. That these people were not just ordinary people. I might look like I'm ordinary, but I'm not ordinary. There is something extraordinary about me. I am a chosen people. I am a royal priesthood. I am holy. Come on. I am peculiar come on God said I'm the head and not the tail I'm above and not beneath I was chosen in him before the foundation of the earth he said to Jeremiah before I formed thee I knew thee and I ordained thee to be a prophet to the nation I ain't ordinary and I, I am extraordinary. I belong to Jesus. I am Jesus, Pinny, Lord God. Haman believed that the Jews had no backative. Haman believed that the Jews. We're a walk over. Who shanda? Rebaba satianda koshe. Let me preach it like I got it. The Lord says, The world believes that the church is a walk over. Lord have mercy. Woo. They think we're foolishness, fanatics. 
ain't got no sense ain't got no power and we're serving a God that doesn't exist that's what they think and Haman thought the same thing but the Bible tells us in Esther 8 that Esther and before we get to 8 in 4 she went before the king we know the story I ain't going back so far I'm stopping right there and the scepter was lifted which means life was given to her and she invited the king to a banquet now watch this when the king came to the banquet the Bible says that he said to Esther, what is your petition? What do you need me to do for you? Oh, can I release it like I feel it? God said to ask you, what is your petition? What do you need me to do for you? She said, you got to help me get from my enemies. My enemies have orchestrated for me to lose my life. And it's already been sealed by you. Oh, Jesus. Now, 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 now watch this. Take my time. All right. A decree that's been made by a king cannot be changed. It can't be changed. And once he seals it with his signet, it settles it. It has to come forth. She said, my enemies, paraphrasing, have assigned not only for me to die, but everybody associated to me. My people are about to lose their lives. He said, where is this enemy? You see, the time you spend crying sometimes, you need to say, God, there is my enemy. Help me up in this place, God. So the Bible tells us, she said, well, this is Haman the Haggai, who is the enemy of the Jews. And the Bible would have it that Haman set up himself in such a way that when the king was out of the room, he went upon the bed that Esther was. And the king said, will you also force the queen? And by the time he could say that, they bagged his head and took him out and hanged him on the same gallows that he set up for Mordecai. I want to tell somebody tonight, go watch the gallows. I ain't going on it. You can build it all you want. Rikandeshai. Build them yellows. I ain't going on it. I ain't going on it. It's not mine. It's yours. So the Bible said they hanged Mordecai on the gallows. And in another chapter, chapter 8, it tells you that the king took. Lord have mercy. Woo. He took the house of Haman and gave it to Mordecai. Lord, can I preach it to somebody because you ain't getting it? You are about to get what your enemy had. That went over somebody's head. 
that went over somebody's head. Can I prove it? In the book of the Old Testament, the Lord told the, the Israelites, he said, I need you to go over into a land that is already possessed. They already have some Amalekites over there. Lord Jesus. It's already occupied. But don't watch the occupancy. I'm going to give you the land. What am I saying? Don't watch who possess it. Don't watch who own it. If God said it's yours, it has to be yours. If God said it's yours, it has to be yours. So Haman died. I'm wrapping it up shortly. And Mordecai was set up over Haman's household. Not only was he promoted in that way. The Bible said that the king took his ring and now gave it to Mordecai. Now watch this. Remember, the decree has already gone out it cannot be changed again the king says to Esther what is your petition the third time this about now second or third time what is your petition she said and I gotta read it because I want you to get it in your spirit the king said in chapter 9 And I'm going to read it. Now, in chapter 8, he said, what is your request? And she said, the issue is they are going to wipe out my people. In verse 11 of chapter 8, and I'm going to read from verse 10. And he wrote in the king. Azurus' name and sealed it with the king's ring and sent letters by post on horseback and riders on mules and camels and young domindries. Wherein the king granted the Jews which were in every city together themselves together. Now he couldn't stop it. But he found a way to overturn it. He couldn't stop it, but he found a way to overturn it. These new letters that were being issued was a way to overturn the first letter. Lord have mercy. It is said that the letter says, gather yourselves together and to stand for your life. Mandiashaya. To destroy, to slay, and to cause to perish all the power of the people and the province that would assault them. So the king gave the Jews permission to fight back. Help me up in this place. He said, I know I can't stop them from coming after you because it's already released. But I can give you power to fight for your life. I can give you power to back yourself. Who am I talking to tonight? God says, I might not always can stop the enemy from attacking you. Because ah, the weapons they are going to form. But while they are forming, they cannot prosper. I can't stop the weapons, but I can weaponize you to fight for yourself. 
I don't think I'm in the right church. Let me slow it down a bit. <laughs> I can always stop the enemy from messing with your children or messing with your money or messing with your health or messing with your job or messing with your house. But he says, I, I can do something else. I can overturn it in such a way that it will look like it never mattered. I wish I had a church up in here. He says, I can't stop them from coming after you, but I can weaponize you by giving you authority to fight for yourself, to fight for your life. To somebody, I've been giving authority in this season to fight for myself, to fight for my family, to fight for my health, to fight for my life. Watch this. He said, both little ones and women, and to take the spoil of them for a prey. Upon one day, in all the provinces of King Azurus, namely, upon the 13th day of the 12th month, which is the month Adar, the copy of the writing for a commandment to be given in every province was published unto all the people. And that the Jews, the Jews should ready against that day to avenge themselves over their enemies the Lord said it is a day of a vengeance it is a season to get revenge you're not helping me up in this place I don't think you're going to understand what me are talking about in a man. I can't preach it now. it's not simpler than this let me tell you something amen had already said on the 13th day of the 12th month the 12th month being December so on the 13th of December we're gonna wipe out the Jews that's what he said it's already signed it's already settled where's elder where's my elder did he leave C come here man of God run coming here yes come on man of God She's looking so beautiful. So this is the first decree. It's beautiful. Signed. Sealed. Delivered. Yours. Woo. Already set in motion. You can't cancel this decree. A decree is final set by a king lord have mercy that's why i say to people when the bible says you shall decree a thing and it shall be established which means we are not the ones making the decree the decree has already been made the decree is the word of god and if i declare and decree the word of god then it's going to manifest lord have mercy help me up in this place help me up in this place so you cannot stop a decree you cannot cancel it. But, but, you can write a new one that overturns the first one. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I wish I had somebody up in this place. I say you can write a new one that overturns the first one in such a way that watch it. It overturned it in a weird way because it couldn't stop it, but it overturned it. 
let's break it down because I don't want you to get confused. The decree was going to still happen. Can't stop it. But he overturned it in such a way, and you're going to get this, before it was one-sided. Bishop, before it was one-sided, because one set of people were going to be assaulted and didn't have the right to fight back. But then the king said, whatever you want to write, write it, seal it. And once it's sealed with my ring, that settles it. So Mordecai knew, I can't cancel it. I can't stop it. But I can overturn it and make it a balanced warfare. Lord have mercy. God said, I'm making it a balanced warfare. He said, I'm going to give you power to fight back. So before it was just come here, man of God, it was just this decree going for the people. But when the king wrote a new one, the new decree, turn around, face the old decree. And now it was decree against decree. Lord of mercy, you ain't helping me up in this place. It was God against the enemies. It's going to be God in this season against your enemies. I will not fight in this battle. I will not fight in this battle. I will not fight. So this decree gave them power. Because the Bible said, you are going to stand up and fight against your enemies. When I read the scriptures, it told me that on the day of the battle, there was fighting in Shushan. And because the Jews got a decree from the king, giving them permission to fight back, it wasn't a walkover. Lord Jesus, look at somebody and tell them it's not going to be a walkover. You ain't going to walk over me in this season. The walkover season done, Lord Jesus. I wish I had somebody online to preach to me. I say, you walk over season, don't you? I stop being a doormat. Now watch this. Matthew says, 11 and 12. And from the days of John the Baptist until now, the kingdom of heaven suffered violence <laughs> and the violent <laughs> mm. take it by force <laughs> in Luke Jesus said Luke 10 and verse 17 he says and the 70 returned again rejoicing Lord even the devils are subjected unto us through thy name <laughs> and he said unto them I beheld <laughs> Satan as lightning fall from heaven. This is your decree. He said, behold, I give unto you power to tread on serpents and scorpions and over. Not some. Not parts, Lord Jesus. But I give you power over all the power of the enemy and nothing shall by any means 
harm you. I'm here to tell somebody tonight. I'm in the season of overturns. It's an overturning season. God is turning over the enemy's verdicts. I'm going to wrap it up. But, but, but watch this. Let's get back to the word. So the Bible said in verse 9 that we were. It says, and on that day, the number of those that were slain in Shushan, the palace was brought before the king. Which means that they went and gave the king a report of the battle that was going on on the outside. Because now it was a battle. Before, it was a suicide or a genocide mission. It was just one-sided. My God, it was just one enemy going to wipe out everybody else. But then the tables were turned. Look at someone and said, the tables are about to turn. The tables are turning. Uh, one thing with God, he does not only build tables, he turns them. I wish somebody could get up and turn around. Just, just get up and turn around in your house. Turn around. Arabash. Uh, Yes, the tables are turning. The tables are turning. The, the tables are turning. Now let me wrap this up quickly. I'm running out of time. And so they brought back a report to the king. Sit down for about five more minutes. They brought a report to the king. And the king said to Esther, Esther. So now you got to be my Esther, woman of God. Esther. Uh, I'm hearing the report of the slain and uh, I've heard that you have destroyed 500 men in Shushan, the palace and uh, 10,000 and the 10 sons of Haman. What have they done in rest of the king's provinces? Now, hmm? I, I, I hear the good report but I want to give you permission to go a little further. Some of you slow. Lord Jesus. He had already been extending favor upon favor upon favor upon favor upon favor to Esther. He said, I'm still in the favor business. I want to give you a little bit more. Lord have mercy. I need 10 people to stand up so I can preach you to you. 10 of you. He said, I want to give you a little bit more favor. Now, what is your petition? And it shall be granted unto thee. Or, or, what is thy request further? Some of you are slow. Let me help you. Remember, he had already given her multiple petitions. Multiple favor. She was already on a high. The people were winning. He said, I hear or heard the good report. But I think... Because you are in the season of rem, you can get some brata. Lord Jesus. He said, I can give you some extras. Do you want some extras? And if you don't want any extra, what do you want me to do further? Lord have mercy. I'm letting you know that in this season, God is saying, what else do you want me to do? What else do you need me to do? What other doors do you want me to open? Who else do you want me to move? Who else do you want me to heal? Who else do you want me to deliver? Esther said, well, I, I can't leave any room for my enemies 
in this season. I ain't first lady. I ain't giving no room for my enemy to come and kill me. Haman got ten shots. Take them out. Everybody. So watch this. The man who orchestrated for Mordecai and Mordecai's people to be eradicated ended up being eradicated. Not only was he eradicated, everybody associated with him, everybody attached to him was moved. It was overturned. It was reversed. It was Watch this. So the Bible said, then said Esther, if it please, if it please the king. <laughs> let it be granted to the Jews, which are in Shushan, to do. Somebody gonna shout. I, w I wish somebody online shouts with me. Now watch this. <laughs> she didn't only just want. Haman's son's head. She wanted another day of war. She said, one day ain't enough to take down my enemies. If it pleases a king, allow us to do what we did today and do it tomorrow. I want to tell somebody what God is allowing you to do tonight. You are going to do it tomorrow and the day after that and the day after that and the day after that and the day after that. You better stop raising him up in here. Shut up. Hold it, no man. She said, if it pleases you, if you're comfortable, if you're okay with it, allow us to fight tomorrow. And not just fight tomorrow. Allow us to take our enemy sons to the gallows that he built for us and hang them now no, no, watch this the bible said and the king commanded it so to be done and watch this again where's elder Come now, man. Another decree. Can you put the scripture up on the screen? I want them to see it. Verse 14 of 9. And the king commanded it to be so. And the decree, a new decree was given at Shushan. And they hanged Haman's ten son. So watch this. Haman's decree was one. The Jews' decree was two. Two against one. said when I overturn the things in the season woo, 
it's going to be two against one. Now, now, now watch how God is so strategic. The first decree could not survive the last two. The first shall be last and the last shall be first. Lord have mercy. What a thing. The decree was not just to hang Mordecai's son. But they got two days to fight. Let's go to numbers. One means oneness. Two means balance. Lord have mercy. God says, I am balancing the play area in this season. Which means the warfare in this season. Now I read something once. I'm diverting a bit, but I want you to get it. That when an eagle is fighting a snake, if the eagle stays in the territory of the snake, the snake has the ability to overpower the eagle and kill it. But the eagle is so smart that the eagle recognizes I got to balance the warfare. So if you catch me down here, I got to take you up in the middle. So it tells you that the eagle then takes the snake up in the ear where it's out of its comfort zone and it doesn't have the capabilities to fight. I hear God said to tell the church, take the warfare of the enemy's zone, come out of the enemy's territory. It's time to balance. It's time to balance the warfare. Hey! Stand with me. Let me wrap it up. Woo! Woo! Look at somebody and say, balance it, man. Say, balance it, man. You can talk about it, but pray about it too. You can cry about it, but worship about it too. You got to balance it. If you cry today, pray tomorrow. And if you pray tomorrow, worship the next day. Woo! Now, now, now watch this. The Bible says, that they went out and they hanged Haman's sons on the gallows that was made for Mordecai. And the Bible tells us in the same scripture in chapter 9 and verse 21. It says, and I'm going to begin at verse 20. It says, and Mordecai wrote these things and sent letters unto all the Jews that were in all the province of the king Azurus, both high and far, nigh and far, to establish this among them. So watch this. The Lord said, after the battles comes the victory. And after the victories, they ought to be established. And against establish, or we say an establishment. Now watch this. When they went out the next day, they fought and they prevailed. Last week we spoke about prevailing. Who shunned that? So they fought and they prevailed. I want you to let you know, you cannot lose in this season. I don't care what they said in immigration. I don't care what the doctor's report said. I don't care what they told you on the job or in the job interview. It's okay. I ain't going to lose in this season. I'm winning in this season. It's my winning season. I'm going to win in this season. Now, the Bible said that after the warfare, Mordecai wrote some things in a letter. And he sent it out in the provinces. And he says that this day that was established, because now they fought on the 13th and the 14th day. And the first day was the 13th day that was set up by Haman. And then the 14th was the second day. He said, on this day, 
the 14th day of December is not going to be an ordinary day. In the month of Adar, we're going to change it. You see, the enemy meant for us to be mourning in this month. Wow, somebody get it. I feel like somebody get it. I felt like somebody got it just now. He expects you to lock up in your house and be bawling your eyes out. But Mordecai said, as the days were in, the Jews rested from their enemies. And the month which was turned unto them. Somebody said turned. It was turned from sorrow to joy. Lord have mercy. Who am I talking to tonight? God is about to turn your sorrow into joy. He is about to turn your sorrow into joy. And from mourning into a good day. A good day is coming. A good day is coming. Weeping may endure for a night. After the night comes a joy. After the night comes a joy, the joy of the Lord is my is my strength. It says that in verse 24. Because Haman, the son of Amadathai, the Agite, the enemy of the Jews, had devised against the Jews to destroy them. And to cast pearl, that is, the lot to consume them and to destroy them. But when Esther came before the king, he commanded by letters that his wicked device. Look at somebody as I say this. The wicked device which was devised against you is going to return to the divisor. Look at somebody else and tell them the wicked device that was devised against you is gonna be returned on the head of the divisor. report is going to be overturned what they told you at school is going to be overturned what they said on your job is going to be overturned what the devil trying to do in your marriage is going to be overturned what the devil trying to do with your children is going to be overturned somebody turn around who shot I feel God in my spirit. Run, come up here, sir. Run, come up here. In the peach shirt. Run, come up. No, run, come. Run, come. Just turn. 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 Take it up. Somebody turn. As you turn in the natural, it's turning in the spiritual. As you turn in the natural, it's turning in the spiritual. God is overturning the divine. Now I'm coming down. Now watch this. The Lord said, What is wrong with the people is this they're not fighting back. Now I'm going to say this and we're going to do something. There are some wicked devices that's been devised by the enemy against us. And when I say us, I mean the church. The church. The enemy wants to shut down the church. Oppress you. Depress you. Confuse you perplex you let you walk around in fear in doubt depression confusion and a ton of warfare is going on there's war with our children 
fighting on the job, in your marriage, in your finances. It's just a lot. But the Lord said, I have given you power. The fact that you got the Holy Ghost, you have power. Greater is He that is in you than He that is in the world. I took a scroll through the news yesterday. And there was so much hurt and pain in the news and so much brokenness and everywhere you scroll somebody got shot somebody got killed somebody made an accident the poor babies lost their lives and parents are broken and there's a war going on war in our he's just a lot of warfare is going on but the Lord said I've given you power and the power that I've given to you is able to turn things around it's not a selfish thing tonight it's a corporate thing tonight every last one of us in here not leaving the way we came there has to be a turnaround. Ooh, Rabahaya. And I hear God say, tell them a two-day turnaround, a two-day turnaround, a two-day. Kibaba no sitanda da rabasha. Elo sata rabahaya. Unda da rabaho sheta na rabako seya. A two-day turnaround, a two-day turnaround. Ooh, shataya bande sataya. I feel that one in my spirit. I feel that one in my spirit. Ela rabasatianda. Somebody got an emergency and God said, I'm going to do it in two days. That lady in the green, come up here. The Lord said, you got an emergency. You. Yes. You need him to do something in two days. It's urgent. It's a urgent. It's a urgent. It's urgent. It's urgent. It's urgent. It is urgent. It's urgent. It's elabasaya. It is urgent. Keti mandi kutusha. A urgent mandi saya. You got an urgent need. You got an urgent need. Elabasianda da revesa ta randa da ravasha. Raba babando se kete de revosha. Landa basaya. Hey. I see asking God today. God, God, where are you in the midst of my situation? Where are you in the midst of my pain? Bandibashia, Rabasato, Rabandosa, Rabababashandea, Maya Bande Katusi. We cancel Mandi Skita Basaya. We cancel every spirit of under the Boshaya from your life. Kundu Shato, Robosekete, Rabababashande de Basata, Rabashianda Rabosa. Somebody worship God in this place. Somebody worship God. Somebody worship God. Somebody worship God. God say, I'm canceling it now. I'm turning it around. Turn around. Lord have mercy. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn. Woo, shatara basaya. Yes, as you turn, it's coming down. It's coming down. It's coming down. Every Jericho wall, every blockage. Lord God, somebody worship the man. Every blockage. Elobosha. Every blockage. Ila basaya. Every block. Elobosha. Tararabosha. The Lord said, we're going to turn things in the realms of the spirit tonight. It's turning. Somebody's about to get a different email. Somebody's about to go back to the doctor and redo their test and the results are gonna be different come run come man is you run come run come yes run come she's slow turning around for me 
whose report will you believe? The report of the Lord. Yes, turn for it. 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 I feel God in this place. Say sooner or later. It's going to turn in my favor. I want to pray for some people who you got bad news regarding your health. Come. Are you me call a long time? I was wondering if it wasn't going to come down here. You're slow. You're slow. You're slow. Kayla Rabasai. Around for me. Around for me. Around for me. Around for me. Ela Rabashaya. Yes, come. Around for me. Bishop, anoint them with oil. Anoint them. Turning around for me. One minute. We're gonna we're gonna merge another song with it. I am troubled. But not forsake cast now Ooh. not destroy I'm a vessel Turning around for me. for me. It's turning around for me. Who shall die? It's turning around for me. 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 Turning around for me. Whose blood work came back? Messed up. Somebody's blood work came back. Kadaba Haya. Where's the water? Lava bandi di bushi. Blat da 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 ba ke sende. Rin da da ba sata. Rin da ba ke sati. Ede de de do ro ro bushi. Da da ba sata. Da da ba bushi. Do ro ro sata. Lord, Lord will perfect what's served in me. Da da ba shai. Sooner or later. Sooner or later. It's time. Somebody lift your hands. Ilaba fretting. Stop fretting. Don't fret. Man daba see. Man don't see what I see. La bandi bashaya. La kuri baha. Hile basi. Kendaraba. Hile rebesa toraba hushaya. The Lord said, You shall not die. Life, I speak life over you. Who shot a rabba? Come lay your hands. Ah, baba shot. Oh, ya baba shot. Ah, ya baba shot. It won't always be like this. The Lord will perfect. The Lord will perfect that. 
There's somebody on the line, um, woman of God, just got a bag put into them. What's the right word for that bag? A colossal bag. Locate that person. They're asking God to heal them. They don't want to live their life with that bag in them. Overturn. Somebody say 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 overturn. Ooh, Shia. We're going to transition into First Lady. I want you to do this song for me. We're going to pray for these at the altar. Banda basaya, kila da basi, hila basi, kina madet, hila basi, ika mashanda, hila basaya. Lift him up, please. The devil giving him visions of death. Bandi basa, evil visions, evil kashanda, evil ketoraba, evil bandi babasato, evil, evil dreams, evil dreams, evil dreams. I'm going to heal you, sick God. I'm going to heal you, sick God. Healing is your portion. Now, 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 now. Now, sick God. Now, sick God. Now, sick God. Now, shut up. Receive it now. I'm working now. I'm healing you now. I'm under the Receive it now. Open your mouth and receive your healing. That's it. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. Jesus. When the saints go to worship, Rabba Basaya. Bishop, pour some olive oil in this and give it to drink. Give him to drink. Woo! Turning it around now. Shindiba. Hila Basai. Whose report will you believe? We shall believe the report of the Lord. Sickness, I see sickness, said God. But I'm overturning them tonight. Ooh. I find in my spirit somebody online has gotten a days to live, but got to live, 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 live. Overturn, I'm overturning, I'm overturning. Usha, and Eba, Spirit of the Lord is walking through this house. Nana Mashika, Rita Reba Bandusa, Rende Nana Nana Mashiki Andusa, Hila Bashaya, healing, healing now. Ooh, healing now. Shaya, now, 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 now. Ooh. When the saints go Ooh. to worship. healing is passing through the altar. That's when healing. I need the church to worship. I need the church to worship. I need the church to worship. Healing. 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 Now, say God, now, say God, now, now. Every trap the enemy set can't work, won't work, and the Strong and mighty. Yes, the king. Listen to her. Holy Ghost. Who is mighty? Lift your hands. Oh, Lift your hands. The king. Lift your hands. Lift it. Lift it. Oh, Lift it. Lift it. Lift it. Heal it. Heal it. Heal it. Heal it. Heal it. Come on, lift it. Yes, that's it. Yes, that's it. Yes, that's it. Yes, that's it. Heal it. That's your healing. That's your healing. 
That's your healing. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Give me another water. Pass it. Give me another water. Holy First Lady, the Lord said to tell the church, worship. Yes. Stop looking. Yes. Yeah. Worship. I need some worshipers. Yes, Lord. Yes, As Lord. you worship, God is overturning some stuff. Yes. Open your mouth and worship. Let me hear the worship going up. Pain. God here about pain. 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 Bless your name. He la basaya, reba basaya, he la da basa, rende kete ya da ya bahaya. He la ba pains all over, pains, cruciating pains. He la ba pain, he la ba si. Even even in your sleep, pains, excruciating pains. Under bad breathing, breathing problems as well. Breathe, he ba se. You have attacks where you feel like you're you're gonna stop breathing. In your sleep, la la ba sicky breathing problem, breathing problem. He la ba pain a heart, a heart, a heart, a heart. He la ba body in the body, he ka ba sicknesses in the body. He la ba depressed, she's also depressed. My God, he masaya say healing to her now. He la ba say, he la ba see, he la ma see me, he ka ma seek me, she must seek me, she must seek me, he ka ma seek unto me. He la God say must seek him. He la ba si, he ba surrender. He la ba your heart. He lo wo shende your mind. He la ba shaya surrender completely. He la ba keturi ba satai. He la ma sanda ba ko shende. He lo bo sata manda re ba kunde kishanda ba usa. He la ba shaya. He lo bo sha. He la ba sha. Come on, lift your hands and worship God. Yes, lift your hands. Lift your hands. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Ela rabasha, come on, open your mouth and worship. Yes, ela rabashanda, ela rabashi. Give her some to drink and give her the rest to take home. Yes, somebody worship God. Sababa sekiara, ela basi, ela basi, ela basaya. What is the problem? I need prayer. Where's Elder? Olive oil. In the name of Jesus. Lay your hands on him and pray. Lay Lift your hands. He have a pain. Where's the pain? Where's the pain? You hear in your eyes? He la rabashaya. Kleto rabasata. Darabakisti and by healing now. You can't see far. You're nearsighted. Can't see far. Everything far is blurry. Healing. 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 Now. Oh, Bishop, come lay your hands. Ooh, lay your hands on her eyes. Hila basaya. Ela ba sinda ba pene deke 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 we cancel rati banda rapa sheke toro musa now open your spirit and receive open your spirit and receive hila ra ba shaya healing in the name of Jesus somebody worship somebody worship yes God say take take it over. Take it over. Take it over. Take the test over. Take it over. Take it over. Lord Jesus. Yes, see there? Take it over. Take it over. Take the test over. Yes, see there? Take it over. Take it over. Take it over. Take it over. Somebody worship God up in this place. 
Somebody worship. Atarabashaya. Hey. Where is it? Where's the pain? In your head, your shoulder. How long have you been having the pain? It's been a while. Give me a water. Nandi basi. Elebede basa karamandi. You're not only having pain, you can't remember things. You can't remember things. You're having problems remembering things. Ilabashaya. Ekabasi. Kitia da ba mind. A mind. Ibasi ka mind. Ilabashanda rabahaya. And you can be doing something right now and you forget. Just like that. Elaba, Reba, Kunda, Kushianda. The Lord said, I'm releasing you tonight. You shatu Raba. You have the Holy Ghost? Elabasa, Nandi ba Kitinda, Basenda, Basa. Take it down for me. You have the Holy Ghost, but you haven't been on track as you should. Yashia Bandu. Elabase. Elabase tonight. The Lord said, Tonight. Kia Manda Rebe Hisaya. He can turn it around for you. I'm gonna turn it around for you. I'm gonna bring back your memory. Alzheimer's running in your family? Anybody in your family has Alzheimer's? You don't know. The devil wanna give you Alzheimer's, early Alzheimer's, or blood of Jesus. Rababashanda, heavy a burden, but but you also have heavy burdens on you, many burdens. Kito rap job and the family, heavy, heavy, heavy. Ida basi, you're working in a competitive, competitive environment. Aya bashanda kemande kasan demand. That's demanding. Ila basi, heavy burden, heavy burden. Ila basi ya rabakushinde, and you're not resting. Eat basi, no rest. Don't sleep at night. Toss and turn. Toss and turn. Ila basi. Ila basi. Even your nice I walk up on the year old. Jesus. Ila basato, masi bandi, she bandisi, a fearful, fearful too. So afraid. Basha, konde de besa. The Lord says he's going to turn it around tonight. Ila rabas. Where's the olive oil? Somebody worship no man. Lord of mercy. Lilo Boshaya. Woo. Rabasa Tere Boshe. Hallelujah. And the God going to heal you tonight. You don't believe? You don't believe? Healing. Healing. Somebody worship God in this place. Somebody worship God in this place. Can we pause the music just one minute? I want to hear the church worshiping. Elder, run with this water for me three times. Just run and come back with it. Healing to your heart, to your mind, to your body. Restoration to your life. God said, I'm going to give you a new tongues tonight and you release I'm resurrecting that which you think was dead. I'm resurrecting. Yes, I'm resurrecting you. Yes, see there? I'm resurrecting you. Yes, see there? I'm resurrecting. Somebody worship the man. Somebody worship the man. Somebody worship. 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 Oh God, somebody worship man. Yes, she's getting our healing. My God, healing. Drink it, man, brother. Drink all of it. God's a healing. I don't think you hear me now. I, I, I released the word already in the atmosphere. I can't do nothing more for you. Open your mouth and worship. My God. Oh, Rabashanda. Yes, the colossus of my bag. Yes, see it here. Somebody say healing. Somebody say healing. Come on, God say healing tonight. He's turning it around. He's turning it around. Oh, shata rabasha. He's turning it around in the name of Jesus. Lord of mercy. Somebody worship God. 
Somebody worship God. I needed to worship. 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 Somebody else is getting healing. Healing. Somebody say healing. I feel the Holy Ghost walking through the altar and healing somebody. Come on, sir. That's it. 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 Lord Jesus, somebody say healing. Somebody say healing. healing. Somebody say healing. healing. Somebody say healing. healing. Somebody say healing. 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 Where's the water? I'm come back it. Oh, Rabbi Come here, sir. What's wrong with you? Jesus. Jesus. Kidney problems. Jesus. Kayla, need another water, Bishop. We need another water. Drink it. Jesus. Hallelujah. Jesus. Hallelujah. I, I don't think you understand. Jesus. I'm expecting a different report. Yes. Lord Jesus. I'm expecting a different report. Lord Jesus. I said I'm expecting a different report. A decree of healing according to the word of God. He was wounded for my transgression. He was bruised for my iniquities. The chastisement of peace. By his stripes. I'm healed. 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 Somebody say healing. Healing. Where's Bishop's thing? Bishop had a thing. Where is it? Bishop is inside? They gone for it? Yes. Bishop put it on. I hear God say healing tonight. And in two days, Lord have mercy. Two days. Two days. I'm expecting a different email in two days. I'm expecting the bank, yes. bank officer to call me back in two days. I'm expecting my supervisor to overturn the decision in two days. I'm expecting the report to come back different in two days. Two days. Hey, Mighty God, some of you don't get it. 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 Healing. Are you on dialysis? Are you doing dialysis? Can't eat. Stress. Somebody say healing. Somebody say healing. 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 You are Alpha and Omega. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Worship. We worship you, oh Lord. Somebody worship the Lord. Somebody worship the Lord. Yes. Somebody worship him. Yes. Come on. Somebody worship him. As you are worshiping, something is happening on the altar. You are Alpha. You are Alpha. Bishop and Omega. Bless it and give him to drink. We worship you. Yes. We worship Come on, Father, you. in the name of Jesus. Oh, Healing now, God. Come on, open your mouth and receive it. 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 Receive. Come on, come on, come on. So 
everybody's standing. We're getting ready to close in a bit. Stand on your feet with me. I have two purses with the colossal my bag. And so, Father, we stretch our hands to the online platform right now. Stretch your hands. We prophesy in the name of Jesus that these bags are coming out. That healing will locate them right now in the name of Jesus. Dry it up, God. Operate, God. Walk into their bodies. Nandina na and overturn. Give them a miracle. Give them a miracle right now in the name of Jesus. Release them, mighty God. Walk through their bodies, God. Fix the problem. Fix it, God. You know what is wrong. Mighty God, allow them to use the bathroom okay and by themselves. We speak divine healing. Healing in the name of Jesus. We cheer down the, the spirit of infirmity. We serve the spirit of infirmity notice. We command that spirit to dry up and die in the name of Jesus. We speak God that healing will manifest now. That healing will take place now. Walk through their bodies God. And have your way in the name of Jesus. Now this is what we're going to do. Lord God. The Lord said it is done. It is done. I'm overturning. I'm overturning some stuff. I want you to, to find one person and hold on to them. And those at the altar, you're gonna be because you form a line, those at the altar, you're gonna pass through and you're gonna touch bishop. That, that, that prior clock that Bishop has. Form one line. You're going to pass. It is done. Even the Alzheimer's person, he's going to receive his healing and his deliverance in his mind in the name of Jesus. The Bible said that when we just read it, the petition, what is your petition? And it was granted. Stage four cancer. You have cancer. Healing. Do we believe God for healing? If you don't have no faith, sit down. Just stage four. Lungs cancer. Can God do it? Can God do it? You know, a lot of times you think you got problems. Eh. She need God to overturn the cancer in her body. Can God do it? Do you believe? Yes. Lord have mercy. I told you that the Lord said to me, a corporate will come out, a corporate release tonight. And what you do today, you're going to do tomorrow. And the day after that. And the day after that. And the day after that. God is overturning some stuff tonight. Untimely death is being overturned. Lord have mercy. My God. That paralysis is being overturned. Ooh. Come on. The decision that was taken in the boardroom that worked against you, it's being overturned. Lord have mercy. The marriage that seemed like it's going to be falling apart and cannot be put back together again, it's being overturned. That decision against your child, 
is being Just overturned. God said, is doing something tonight. Comes. Somebody just go ahead and worship him. You're getting ready to close. Now, if anybody else is sick, come in the line. If you need healing, come in the line. Come in the line quickly. We're going to do this quickly. 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 He's able to do what he said do he's able able to do what he said he will do he's able there's somebody online that has to go back and do a test I just hear the Lord said it's cleared find that person Peter and somebody has to go back and do another screening a test God said it's clear, 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 clear. As Bishop stands here tonight, and I'm going to say this again. What is your petition? Healing. When you come up here, believe whatever it is, it's being overturned. And before we even start touching this garment, we're going to worship the Lord. Because we're doing this in 10 minutes and I'm going to close. Lift your hands all over this place. Open your mouth and start to worship. Yes, open your mouth and start to worship. Open your mouth and start to worship. Open it up, Satan, da 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 Are you saved? Are you baptized? He's able. You need to come back quick, 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 quick. Man, de basaya. You need to run for your life. Mighty God. Basaya. Bas you have a lot of different problems. What type of issues you have? Problems. Yeah. Lord have mercy. Heart problem? Diabetes? You have to get a beep up machine. That's the one that if your heart stops, it beeps. Jesus Christ. I tell you, she have whole heap of problems, heart problem, pressure problem, diabetes. And you don't have the money to get the machine. Eh? Yeah, that's what I say, you don't have the money to get the machine. It's 203,000 feet. You see? Somebody say healing. Healing. The, the Lord is showing me she's a walking time bomb. At any minute, she can lose her life. That's why the Lord said, run, come back quick. We're going to cancel that tonight. Cancel it. Come on, Virgin, open your mouth, shut your hands to her. Where's the olive oil? Nanda pain, 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 pain. Ila basaya, ila breathing problem too. Ila basi, ila basai, ila basaya, ila bashanda, ila masande kitoro bosinda bahai, ila basi kitoro bosi. You struggle to come tonight, you know? Cause the devil telling you say, God no want nothing to do with you. God don't want nothing to do with you. And you're evil and wicked and you must just die and go hell. The devil is a liar. Devil is a liar. Elo bo shaya. Devil is a liar. Rabanda kushanda. Ele bo kusianda rabahaya. The blood of Jesus. De la basi. Restoration is in here tonight for you. Restoration. Come on, just worship. Lift your hands. Yes, lift your hands. Open your mouth. Ela basaya. Ela rabashanda. In the name of Jesus. Yes. 
Here. Drink it. Mighty God. We're ready. Hold the music. I don't have to touch you. Let's get that out of our heads right now. Yes. The atmosphere charge. is already charged. Yes. All I need you to do, and I'm asking for 10 minutes and somebody be my timekeeper, please, is worship, please. We've been doing this for almost three months now. Mm. I'm not going to pump you to worship. That's right. Thank God. I'm not going to do it. The atmosphere is already charged for your healing. All God needs you to do is worship. As you worship, brethren, God will turn it. Look here. As you worship, he's turning it. As you worship, he's turning it. As you worship, he's turning it. Elabashaya. Mighty God. Are we ready, Pastor Bishop? You, they're in the line. The line is this way. Did you find them? Elder. Do me a favor. Oh, you're both come. Sorry, John. One here, one over there. Where's Dahlia? Yeah. We're gonna walk through. The Bible says, the go back and test. All right, give it to me before I hand over to Bishop. 10 minutes on the clock, thank you. I hope you're leaving with all of these things tonight. It is God who's turning it. God's decree is going to override that of the adversary's decree. Yes. What God has released in this season is what your petition is when you ask is going to be granted. He said within two days. Two days. Two days from now is when? Friday. Friday. By Friday, 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 God, God. Hey! Woo! Shaya Bande Sataya. My God, by Friday, good news. Good news. I've been getting bad news. But God said, I'm turning around the bad news to release good news. Lord have mercy, somebody worship God in this place. Now, the people in this line is about to get a miracle. Healing is in the building. Lord have mercy. Healing is in the building. It's online. As well. Loose, loose, God. Loose, God. Mighty God. Yes. Mighty God. And we're going to one last song, musicians. Because when God is overturning things, it means that he is shifting the atmosphere. He's changing the atmosphere. And as you touch Bishop tonight, wearing that garment, Ilabasaya, come Delia, we're going to walk through. Ilabasa, Torobo Shandai. As you andabashaya, healing is coming in your body. Lift your faith. 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 Ilabashaya, mighty God. Somebody lift your faith. Ketando bo Somebody lift your faith. Rabando shataya. 
Somebody lift your feet. Rima baba kushata ya. Rima baba baba kushata. Indi katanda bose. I feel somebody fail rising. I feel somebody fail rising. I feel somebody's 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 fail rising. Ela baba baba kushete ne mo sata. Raba baba kushata ya na 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 se. See there, see there, see there, see there. See there, see there, see there, see there. Somebody watch it. Go to start touching. Just worship right here, sir. Yes, as they pass. Yes. Come. Heal it. I'm going to give you a bottle of water before I leave. Just go. Yes, power to save. Power to Heal it. Heal it. Heal it. Heal it. Heal it. There is only one day. There is only one day with power to save. Heal it. Heal it. Power to Heal it. Era da mocha. Era da mocha. Era da mocha.
That's your healing. That's your healing. Somebody's a 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 healing. Somebody lift your hands and worship in this place. What a release. What a healing. What a healing. What a healing. What a healing. We're closing with what I told you to do before. Bishop, let her hold on to it a little longer. That lady in the green. Hold on to it a little longer. Healing coming in your body. Manda Rabasaya. See, dear, take it. Take it. Take it. See, dear, take it. Yes. That's your healing. Yes. two minutes left on the clock. Grab a hold of your neighbor. We're closing. My sickness got to go. The Lord says sickness got to go. Headaches got to go. Somebody having terrible headache. Terrible headaches. Healing, healing, healing. Healing, Hila must say, healing. You're healed. You're healed. Ela Basaya. You're healed. In Daraba Hushaya. Healed. Ela Daraba Hushata and Daraba Sati Bahai. Healed. 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 Squeeze your neighbor hand and shout, healed. Squeeze your neighbor hand and shout, healed. Yes, Alzheimer's healed. Kate Babando Sataya, arthritis healed. Mandebo Shaya, mental illnesses healed. Come on, squeeze the neighbor hand and say healed. Say healed. Say healed. Say healed. Say you are healed. 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 Tell them it's overturned, not God. Prophesy to them and say it's overturned. It's overturned. It's overturned. It's overturned. And this is what we're gonna do. And I know my musicians are tired, but we're gonna go with our musicians before I hand over the pastor. I want you to give me an overturned praise break. Don't let go of your neighbor. Don't let go of your neighbor. Say, neighbor, I'm doing this tonight. I'm doing it tomorrow. I'm doing it on Friday. Because it's overturned. Start to dance with your neighbor. My time is up. But start to dance with your neighbor. If you're online, get up in your house. Oh, shut up. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Why do look so stiff? And some of you used to broke out a dance. I'll go by your head top. Lord of mercy, we're not doing that tonight. Come on, Mr. Drum, I want to hear the drums. I, I, I want to put up. Yes! Somebody give me all my time, praise break.
overturned. What the devil meant for evil, 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 overturned. Be God in here. Bishop, over to you. Rejoicing. Yeah. He said, the day that the enemy meant for you to be sorrowful right. is going to be your day yeah. of rejoicing. Before Bishop comes, that is my third time handing over to him. But Bishop, I get two minutes. I need my men to give me a march. Come, Brother Masha. Lead a march to me now with the men. I hear God say, I'm turning it. Lord Jesus. Arabasaya. If you're online, get up in your house. Start to move your feet. I hear God say, Don't wait till the battle is over. Shout now. Shout now. He turned it. 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 
something for me. Now they said that, holy musician, they said that men not in church and men shot. Take a good look. Now some warriors this. Amen. There, no, no warriors them here? Yeah, man. Mighty men of value. Mighty God. Strong men. Lord Jesus. He turned it. It's turned around for my good. Now, I want the men to do this for us, and our bishop is going to close us. I want the musicians. I don't know your name, sir. What's your name? LJ. Brother LJ. You know, back in the days in Bishop's time, yeah, Bishop think him young enough, but you know, he is. <laughs> I know my age. I love you, Bishop. I know my age. In Bishop's time, and I'm going to say, Kita, Reba, hi. And I'm going to do something I didn't plan to do, but it's in my spirit. But grab me my purse, woman of God. Grab two, two of anything. Two $2,000, $2,500, $2,500, $2,500. I hear God say, sow into it. I'm going to sow into it. My two days miracle, I got to sow into it. My two days miracle, I feel like sowing into it. It wasn't in my spirit before, but it just dropped in it. I'm going to do it. You, you find money in my purse? Where's my purse? I got some money in there. Two or anything in there. Grab it, care, come give me. Grab two of anything. Two five thousand. Two one thousand. Two two hundred. Two fifty. As the Lord is leading you. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Pull it, pull it, pull it. Yeah? Okay, I got two, two, two thousand dollar bill. Grab, grab something with me. Two, 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 five thousand, two, two thousand, two, no man, hold on to your two. Keep it, keep it. Two, two days. Okay, grab it online. Somebody say online, well, they're left out online. I don't know, Peter Gay, are they left out online? Bring it up. Put, tell them how they can give their two. Yeah, man, two. Two of anything. Make sure it's two of the same thing. We are balance it out. Balance, balance, balance. Lord have mercy. I hear God say, cancel it out. Lord God, me I cancel it out. Me I cancel it out. Don't come drop it yet. Don't drop it yet. Hold it, man. No, so wait, no. It has to break, man. That's some mashup. Yes, yes, yes. Ketobo sata. Mash it up. Yes, God, we can't sing it out. We're going back to the old school. Give me that old school Pentecost. Old time. Dance something. And the men, because they're already at the front. I want the men to worship and drop their money first. We're letting you lead tonight. You're the priest. Lord of mercy, yes, God. Oh, Shia. God, I'm getting ready to turn things around in the life of the men. And if you're standing beside our brother and him don't have nothing to give, put something in him hand. Look and make sure every brother has something to give. If you seem to have nothing in him hand, forgive. Drop something in him hand. Squeeze something in him hand. Squeeze a two. Squeeze something. Ladies, yeah, if you see sister and have nothing to forgive, give her something. Corporate breakthrough. Corporate blessing. And next week, Wednesday, when I come, I'm giving you about some minutes out of my preaching time. Because I got to hear these testimonies. I hear God said, This is an emergency move, an emergency release. Immigration documents release. Where's Prophet Smolton on the line to agree with me? I said, Immigration documents release. Reverse it, overturn it. God is pulling somebody passport out of decline and put it in a approve. Lord Jesus. Somebody shout approve. Approve. Are we ready? Go ahead. Let me hear you. Let me hear it. Yes. Come, brothers. March upon church. We follow your lead. In our shire. Yes, release it. Yes, in the name of Ladies, clap your hands. Ready, praise him. He turned it. I said he turned it. Turn it around. Turn it. He turned it. 
sold into this word in the name of Jesus you said in two days yes God mighty God yes 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 God. in the name of Jesus mighty God thank you Jesus say it again yes Lord the Lord says say it again yes Lord two days two days Look at somebody and say two days. Two days. Somebody online put it in the chat. Say two days. Two days. In 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 two days. Yes, Lord. There's a turnaround. An emergency turnaround. A victory turnaround. Yes. Yes. Father, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We stand in this season. Yes, Lord. We believe. We receive it. We are no shy. Yes. In the name of and God. as we have sold on the word, let it manifest. Let there be a turnaround. Turn around. In our health. Yes, Lord. In our marriages. Yes, Lord. In our families. Yes, Lord. In our business. Yes, Lord. In our jobs. Yes, Lord. In our ministries. Yes, Lord. With our children. With our immigration papers. Yes, Lord. With jobs. And universities, yes, Lord. yes, with loans and houses, yes, Lord. and mortgages, yes, yes, Lord. 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 It is so. Over to you, Bishop. It is so. In the name of Jesus. It is Ooh, so. Ah, Rabbi. Oh, In I need to pray days. for those people. In two days. There were some people that you gave me some names for. Joan has them. Those were the people. Yes, yes, yes. Hallelujah. For the test. Father, in the name of Jesus. Where is the paper? In the name of Jesus. You gave it to me? In yes. The Messiah? Yes. We Lord. hold up this paper for those who are online. Yes, in the name of Jesus. You know their names. In the name of Jesus. And we come in agreement. Yes, Lord. That as they go to redo these yes. tests, there will be a change we speak in the, the results. In the name of Jesus. Change blood works. In the name of Kilabasa Jesus. Tora Bohoya. Yes, Lord. Clear that pap smear. Babandusha. Clear you. that ilabasa tunda rabahaya. Release your blood now, God, to take them through the test. It is. Kilabase korobosatai. 
Send angels before them now. And we stand in agreement that it is done. For you said within two days. And you said that you have overturned what the enemy meant for evil in this season. It is overturned. In, in Jesus' name, Jesus. somebody praise him. In God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. In two days, stand Ooh. on the word of God. And believe in two days. Yes. God said in two days, look for your miracle in two days. In two days. Look for your turnaround in two days. Yes. Look for your breakthrough in two days. In two days. Somebody say in two days. Somebody say in two days. In two days. My miracle in two days. Now put your hands together and praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Two days. Raise your right hand as we get ready to close. Hallelujah. Now unto him who is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before his presence with exceeding joy. To the only wise God our Savior be glory, majesty, dominion and power both now and forevermore. Everybody say amen. And again we say amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. In two days.